What is up, guys? Pikachu 49 here, and we are back, sort of, on the Desolation map. This is an alternate save. Got something special planned for you today. We're outside of the Strand. You know what's coming, guys. If you're following me, you know that the Strand is done. So what could I possibly be doing outside of the Strand right now? Well, I'll tell you. I'm building a mini game, guys. Oh, baby. I haven't decided on the title of this mini game yet, but uh, it's gonna be in the strand. It's gonna involve the strand. We're gonna fight each other in the strand. Oh, baby. We have tested a little bit of strand for PvP. Now I'm ready to make an official game. I got a good idea. I think it's gonna work. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. This is untested. I haven't built it yet, obviously, so we haven't tested it. But let me get to work right away here. We don't have a lot of time. This is the way the game is going to work. There are going to be two teams. There are going to be the shoppers and the strand employees. Where are we going to put these beds? I want the shoppers to start in the church. So we'll put a bed here and a bed. Hmm, they should all have their own chest. We may have to get rid of the holy water. Oh, no. I, I like the holy water, but it's got to go. It's just got to go. We'll replace the holy water, guys. Don't worry. We'll replace it. We'll put it right here. All right, no one is moving the holy water. All right, it's right there. So there's a bed, there's a bed, there's a bed, there's a bed. Perfect. And chest, 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 chest. Okay, so these are going to be the shoppers. And they're going to start in the church. Now, is that going to affect spawning? No, we should be good. Okay, now the other team are going to be the strained employees. And they're going to start on the roof of the strand. So let's start them up over here. We'll start them right here. Okay, perfect. Perfect, perfect. Right there. Get rid of those and those. They're going to start right here. And they're going to have some chests as well. Oh. <laughs> there you go. I don't think that will affect spawning. We should be good. One, two, three, four. Beautiful, beautiful. Now let's um, let's do these guys first. First thing I'm gonna do is give them some swords. They each need a sword. That much is clear. There's gonna be PvP, guys. This is a PvP game. I don't have a name for this game yet. Uh, I might. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be thinking of names while I build this. So if you guys have a name for this, let me hear it. I'm all ears. Uh, I'm usually pretty good at making up names for stuff. But right now, I don't have a name, so... Hmm. Well, you guys gotta know, like, what the game is first. Okay, so this is the way the game works. The people who spawn in the Strand, these are the employees of the Strand, are each gonna start with a special item. I got a Power 5 bow here. I'm just, I'm just replicating Power 5 bows so I have enough for everybody. Uh-oh. I got game chats coming through. Hold on, hold on. How do I... Ooh. Let me start a party, and then let me mute the party, because I don't like when game chats come through. I don't know if that's even coming through in my audio or not. I don't like it. Okay, mute the party. There we go. Anyway, um, I'm what I'm doing here is I am copying... Do I need this many? I'm copying the bow. I don't think I need this many. That's too many by a lot. Oh, well. Oh, well. <laughs> we got them. Now we got them. We started from the bottom. Now we got them. Okay, so anyway, ah, the objective of the game, uh, it's better if uh, you guys see it. So let me just make this, uh, make these chests and you'll see what the game is about, okay? All right, now we got all our bows. Yes, thank you, thank you. This is a great way to copy stuff, uh, you know, if you're going to enchant stuff. I only need eight. I don't know why I made like 19 of these things. <laughs> I only needed eight. I'm just, uh, you know, better safe than sorry, I guess. I only need eight. Oh well, let's give it all those, then we put some of these in here. Follow along guys, follow along. I know, kind of spacey. Let's actually double up on these arrows. Two stacks each, right? Two stacks each. We got a lot of people coming and going. A lot of people coming and going. That's a good opportunity for me to tell you guys that I always have my game open. You're always welcome to join. As long as you stay out of my way while I'm building or recording a video, we're going to have no problems. You can come in, you can look around, you know, you can uh, have fun in here. I'm all about sharing and, and having fun as 
long as you stay out of my way. Okay. So we got the defensive stuff. Oh, we do need jerseys. We do need jerseys. Don't forget the jerseys. What color should they be? What color should the jerseys? The strands, to me, they feel like the strand is a red jersey. You know what I mean? Is the strand is red, so the employees would probably be wearing red. I know that each store would have different clothes for the employees, but in the interest of the PvP, the strand is one united corporation. <laughs> okay? Alright, the strand employees are wearing red. And we need to rename something. We need to rename... What should we rename, though? Huh. Maybe these red blocks of redstone? Okay, that's good, that's good. We need to rename this. We're going to call these presents. I wanted to call them Christmas presents, but not everybody celebrates Christmas. So they're just presents, okay? They could be Hanukkah presents. They could be Kwanzaa presents. It could be any kind of presents, okay? So we're going to put one in each thing here. So this is what... Okay, now I can explain the game. This game works... Offense versus defense. The strand employees, the chest I'm building right now, the team I'm building right now, these are the defensive team. This is the defensive team. Okay, sorry guys, I'm just distracted right now. All these people coming and going. Okay, so it's four on four. One starts in the strand, one team starts in the church, and before the game starts, this team here, the strand team, has a few minutes, we'll say two minutes. To each of them will hide their Christmas present. Oh no, not Christmas present, their present present. And they can hide it anywhere in the strand. For instance, they can come into the fish shop, they can go in the back, and they could hide their present right here. Okay? They, they put up their present in there, and they must leave it there. Okay? Now, once that two minute grace period is over, the people in the church, the consumers, the people trying to buy the presents, these are the consumers here, they have 10 minutes to locate one present and bring it back here. That's how they win. Does that make sense to you guys? 10 minutes to find a present and bring it back. The strand employees will be defending those presents with their lives. Oops, I forgot that we need two here. With their lives. Okay, does that make sense to you guys? Does that sound fun? It's attack and defend. Um, the team who's attacking will... I mean, they have pretty good stuff. They have pretty good stuff. I'm going to make it even, I think. Uh, infinite respawns. Keep inventories on so you're not going to have to worry about lives or anything. It's a, it's a constant respawning wave of people. Okay, that's why we have the 10 minute time limit. I think that'll be perfect. It'll be great to make YouTube videos with. 10 minutes, perfect. Perfect length, right? Uh, so I'm hoping to make YouTube videos. I'm hoping to play this a lot. Uh, you know, obviously we're going to have to do a lot of tweaking and amending. Uh, that's what I do with my games is I'll invite people to come play and then I'll tweak it a little bit and get the game mechanics right. Now what color jerseys? These are going to be black. Yes, the black jerseys. The black consumers. These are the people who... You know, they've forgotten what uh, the holidays are about. The holidays are about love and giving to your loved ones and friends and loved ones. And it's not about the price tag. You know what I mean? It's not about rushing to the malls. It's about giving love, not about giving material items. Okay? So these people are evil. <laughs> in, this, in the context of this game, these people are evil. Now, I do want to give them a little bit of an advantage. And by... And in so doing, you know what, guys? You know what? I've changed my mind. I've changed my mind. Let's do this. I think this will help with the game balancing. They're each going to get one Ender Pearl. You know, use it wisely. Use it wisely. They're also going to get one TNT, I believe. I think that'll be cool. Just one. Just one. Don't abuse it, guys. Now they have no way of lighting this TNT, so what I'm going to do, oopsies, what I'm going to do is amend these bows. Yes, they will be amended. Okay, so give me your bows. Everybody give me your bows. There we go. Change these bows out. And then what I'm going to do is give it some flame. Oops, not a jukebox. I'm a flame. La Flama Blanca. All right, here we go. 
Here we go. Give him the flame. Oh, I need four books. Oh, not one book. I need four books. Come on now. Let's get rid of this. Create some inventory space. Now, Aiden, what are you doing? What are you doing, Aiden? Come on. Can't you... I know you guys are... Sometimes you're bored. You don't know what to do. Don't you guys have projects? Does anyone have a project around here that they're working on? All right. If you guys play Minecraft on a daily basis and you don't have a project in the works, what on earth are you doing? <laughs> it doesn't have to be creative. It could be in survival. But what are you doing? If you're not building something at the moment, what kind of Minecraft player are you? If this is how you spend your time, guys, jumping around back and forth, you need a project. Right? If this is how you spend your time, you're not using your time wisely. Go do something. Okay? Go do something, guys. Seriously. I know I find myself doing this from time to time, and I'm like, oh my goodness, I was jumping around on blocks for 10 minutes. Do you know what I could have done in 10 minutes? I could have done a lot of things. Stop doing this, guys. Always be on that grind. Always. I know that, uh,. A lot of you um, see building as work, and if that's the case, why are you playing Minecraft? Anyway, anyway. Alright, I think we got it, right? Do we need anything else? We got the Christmas presents, we got the spawn set up. I think we're GTG, guys. GTG. So, check my Twitter. I have posted a Twitter announcement saying when we're going to play PvP. By the time you watch this, we have already played PvP, but this is for the future, guys. If you want to play in the future, check the Twitter. Yeah, yeah. Update's probably out right now, so who knows if you're even watching this. <laughs> you're probably gone playing the update, but whatever. I'm still making these videos. Always going to be making these videos for you guys. That's what I do. Alright, guys. That is... Hey, what's the name of it? The Consumer Caper? I don't know. Something to do with the Strand. Strand and Deliver? <laughs> the presents? I don't know. Strand and Deliver? Maybe. Aiden, get out of here! I'm gonna kick you. Go do something, Aiden. I'm mad. I'm mad when people are bored. How could you be bored? Never say the B word to me. Look at this world. You think I'm ever bored? I got a million things to do. That's how you fight boredom, guys. You start a project. Go start a project, Aiden. I'm serious. All right, guys. Thank you for watching. Thank you for leaving a like. Thank you for coming through and playing the PvP. Oh, it's going to be fun. All right. Happy Minecrafting. Peace.